Hello, welcome to this video tutorial. Today we are going to talk on how to manage uh, Azure scale set, mainly how to start and stop uh, the virtual machine we create under uh, Azure. So, whenever you create uh, a normal virtual machine, if you go to my resource here, and here I've created I've already created a resource group containing a normal virtual machine. If you click on the virtual machine here, you will notice that here directly we have option to start and stop the virtual machine. However, if we go and create a new resource group containing scale set, here to make the video short, I've already created one scale set uh, with only one instance of the virtual machine. <coughs> so here is the name of our resource group and here is our virtual machine. Here, the next one is uh, the load balancer, public IP virtual uh, network and those uh, different uh, five, these are the or the different storages. So our hard disk. Now, if you click under the virtual machine, then we notice like here we have no option to start and stop the virtual machine. The only option we have is to delete it. And so that's where the problem come. Because if you try to look at different option, different option here in the portal, you'll find no way how to do that, at least for now. So in order to manage the virtual machine that we created on the skill set, we have to use a uh, Azure Power, you have to use Microsoft Windows PowerShell ISE. If you don't have it, you can install it, and not that it will not work with the normal PowerShell. So, you have to create uh, this uh, Azure PowerShell. <coughs> so, after that one is done, now you have to log in using a uh, at Azure RM meaning resource manager, then account. Not that the normal, uh, it will not work, okay, with the normal command that is Azure account. So now if you log into our account now, you will pop up for authentication. Here, I just enter my ID. Please don't hack it. <laughs> okay, Outlook. And then uh, come now the password and boom, we are in so <coughs> now we have to after logging in we have to go through uh, check our resource and see the details to do that one we will use uh, this command here Note that here you have resource here is resource group here is this name that we have here this is the name of our resource group and then the next thing here is the VM scale set name our scale set name is this one here that's VM set shell so if we launch it here <coughs> so here you are going to have detail about a different all the detail about the virtual machine if you have many instances then you have many id here and, and so on <coughs> so you have many options so then after we create it we see this we see the details now the next thing is how to start our virtual machine to start our virtual machine here we run this follow the following command here here you see start iphone and azure resource remote resource manager then vm set scale set so <coughs> if we fire this command here and and if you go here i would like to show you one thing here if you go to the load balancer you notice that uh, uh, not load balancer 
okay here you know see there's no ip showing here because right now our thing is down now it's coming because we started then we started then the next thing is if you go to i think the load balance you go to the load balance then not rules And you see here this is this, this the name of our IP here and if you click here <coughs> you see that the port that we are going to make our remote desktop is 5000 is 50 sorry 50,001 so <coughs> if you go on remote desktop and just uh, copy our IP Uh, if we copy our IP from here we can easily copy it from here so click on this icon then it's copied then we come here and then replace this one by our IP here then pam you see here you will pop for uh, you will pop for the authentication now if we enter the password then we are going to get access to the virtual machine so now after that one is done now we can go back uh, to our skill set to stop the virtual machine here the same command is used but here starting with stop and if uh, we stop it <coughs> if you just run this command here our virtual machine is going to uh, it's taking some time so after running this command there the, our power down machine is going to shut down and then there are also some command that i'm going to pass paste on the youtube you can also remove your you can also remove uh, the, the scale set using this freedom command remove and and so on I hope that uh, you have at least uh, you have uh, understood the essence of this tutorial that be able to start the virtual machine scale set and stop it and manage it we don't have to do that we don't do that at least for now from the portal we have to use the PowerShell to to do it so Thank you for watching this video tutorial. I hope that you enjoy it and see you. Bye.